المسؤولية القانونية اللي بيتم تطويرها دلوقتي اللي الخبراء بيشتغلوا عليها لسه مستمرين في جوانب كتير قوي معقدة بنحاول ببساطة لحضراتكم بس علشان تفهموا كمان أكتر يبقى فيه يعني نظرة أشمل على هذا الموضوع لأي درجة الذكاء الاصطناعي متداخل مع حياتنا خلونا نتابع في القصير ومستمرين طبعا في النقاش It is a dream come true. Sometimes it can be wonderful to hear this statement, and other times it can be scary. As human beings, we cannot stop dreaming of a better life. We cannot stop searching for innovative solutions to facilitate our lives. This is humanity's ultimate goal. From the Stone Age, the invention of the wheel, to the fine age of artificial intelligence today, everything has been all about making our lives easier. AI is a system with abilities that can learn to achieve goals and adapt the new information. Although we're using the word AI heavily today, it is not a new concept at all. AI has been around since the 1950s, taking many years and experiences to be in the highly advanced form that we see today. Varying between machine learning that needs structured and labeled data and deep learning that work nearly in a similar way to the human brain, through analyzing and conceptualizing, we can definitely feel the AI impact on our daily lives. From problem-solving aspects that can start from a simple game to an autonomous weaponry system, to knowledge building to an extent that can present knowledge about the world, analyze markets, prevent from fraud, and make medical diagnosis, to planning by setting goals and achieving them efficiently, communicating with spoken and written languages through voice control, and having the ability of elation through the sensory inputs. All of these are the superpowers provided by AI to help people. But does it really help everyone? Last year, the owner of Facebook faced accusations of exploiting vast amounts of private data, and the entire world recognized the danger of owing people's personal data. Not only can AI affect people's lives, but it can also make fateful changes in various countries, especially when countries vary in the levels dealing with AI technology. The sheer volume of information on the planet's surface has shown the inevitability of needing newer technologies that can make use of all these data and store it. Taking into consideration the AI enormous capabilities, nuclear tests and weapons had to face the threat of restrictions despite their adverse impact on humanity. So we may now ask a simple question. Is it possible that they would be legalized? Hence, the notion to regulate the use of artificial intelligence and establishing rules and laws to deal with it is not a novelty. In some countries such as China, in May 2019, the Bikin Academy of Artificial Intelligence began to consider ethical principles related to the use of AI, which included avoiding the negative effects of the malignant intelligence. This is maintained by continuing preventive and predictive policy making regarding augmented intelligence. In some other countries, such as Germany, the UK, the European Union, and the United States of America, multinationals are required to produce ethical evidence about their AI activities. All of these legal moves at the level of states raise the inevitability of an international action that can codify these technologies ethically and preserve the security of the state's information. But are the international laws and manufacturers able to realize, understand, and control the complex technology that grows and develops in the laboratories? Will the balance of power and the formulation of laws remain solely in the hands of the state, or will it be in the hands of the companies that own the new technologies? Will the world lose its control over such companies, and so lose control over the technology and lead humanity to its destruction? From the dynamite of Noble to facilitate mine access, 
to the nuclear development for energy uses, all the way to the artificial intelligence to facilitate human life. Each of these dreams has come true, but mankind also afford the scourge of its fulfillment.